show you some before and after photos and then we'll talk about the build. Do a quick walkthrough on what materials we use, what tile, type of layout, what type of waterproofing. So here we go, before and after photos. And Okay, we usually start with the floor. This is the original floor. This was installed by somebody else about a year ago. Six by 24, we kept the floor. We were responsible for the vanity, paint, drywall, some hardware, and the shower. So we'll start with the vanity. This is a double undermount sink vanity, marble top, blue gray in color, brush nickel hardware handles, and of course you've got the slow close, just like that. Again, two undermount sinks with brush nickel faucets. Installed a couple of medicine cabinets, towel bar, toilet, little storage cabinet for toiletries. All right, let's take a look at the shower. This is a walk-in shower. We just got done installing this frameless glass door. Again, you've got brushed nickel for the hardware on this frameless glass door. Took a couple hours to install. Let's take a look at the shower. We'll quickly talk about prep and waterproof. We've got green board with Schluter Curdy membrane wrapped around the shower. A full Curdy shower kit down here. Got the Curdy pan, curb, and drain kit with drain cover. Let's talk about the tile and layout. Like usual, 50% offset. Started with grout lines in the middle. Everything is symmetrical. All the way to the top. This is a 12 by 24 non-rectified porcelain. Here is the mosaic inlay. Here we've got travertine as well as metal covered decorative mosaic. The stripe turned out nice. We've got a brush nickel trim kit here and shower head. Installed a new valve, raised up the shower head. Let's take a look at the niche. 12 by 20 inch niche. Now this trim is Schluter Rondek PVC. Small, low profile quarter round. And as you can see, it matches our bone grout color quite well. Customer wanted to go with this trim to tie in a few things, to tie in a travertine on the inlay, as well as the Schluter Rondek, as well as the bone grout. And it matches very well with the pan tile, as you can see. And that's pretty much it. The shower build took about three, four days. Whole project about a week. 
clean, neutral, good looking shower. There's the curb. We've got the Schluter ROM deck on the curb as well. All the colors tie in together to complement one another. Again, thanks for watching guys. Stay tuned for Bath and Shower Tile Ideas episode 22. I'll see you on the next one. No, I